Um, hi everyone. Um, I've uh, had a go at a couple of uh, tunes um, for you. I uh, I'm st still hooked on the Gertie. Uh, I'm playing on this one, uh, this machine. Um, this is uh, the first instrument that I heard that convinced me that a Gertie wasn't a god awful instrument that nobody could ever play. Um, when a uh, friend of mine, a guy now, who's now a friend of mine, sat down next to me in a session at a channel in Southern California in an empty seat, and so I was trapped having avoided Gertie players for years. And he started playing this. Uh, this is a, a Gertie by an Austrian uh, luthier named Wolfgang Weichselbaumer. Class name, right? Um, and uh, I was absolutely astonished because it, it just sounded beautiful, um, almost like a, a string quartet had sat down next to me and started playing. Um, and then one of these fell into my lap a few years later. Um, anyway, um, the tunes... Sorry, the tunes I'm going to give a shot at. A um, couple of unusual tunes um, from uh, this book. This is uh, Playford's Dancing Master. Playford was uh, one of these really early music publishers, published a collection of um, uh, dance music in 1651 originally, and then every year for until like the early 1700, 1728 or something like that. Um, probably said on the front of that thing. Uh, and uh, at least the, it latterly became Playford's English dancing master, but especially the first version had tunes from all over, including Ireland in it. Um, the two tunes I'm going to play, the first one is called Kettle Drum, uh, and the second one is called The Glory of the West. And I got them from the playing of Chris Wood, an English fiddler, and Jean-Francois Vraud, a French fiddler, who uh, made a, a fabulous recording some years ago. Um, and I originally uh, started playing them for the Broadway Button Club, introduced them to the Broadway Button Club, because uh, I heard another guy playing them on a button box. Um, and I thought we were going to get at them, but the Broadway Button Club, um, or Buttons and Bellows Club, what do we call it? I can't remember. Anyway, uh, Caitlin of Tune Supply uh, founded it. And... Um, it's sort of on, uh, shall we say, hiatus at the moment, as you might imagine. But I've kept playing these tunes and try to make something of them. So uh, anyway, here's a go. I don't know what kind of tunes they are. Maybe some kind of Scottish or something. Who knows? Anyway, I hope you like them. <laughs> 